Lucky enough to have my mom here with me today. She is the most influential woman in my life and I attribute everything I am to her perpetual love, support, and guidance. She is a wife, sister, friend, and mom of five kids, four dogs, and three cats. I do not think I have met a more caring, level-headed woman in my life. My mom has an open mind, and though she is incredibly convicted to her beliefs, she welcomes new thoughts and perspectives to flood her mind. My mom always tries to look at people, situations, and the world through rose-tinted glasses. However, she is incredibly intelligent and wise. I tell her all the time she could probably be the president, my doctor, and my teacher all in one. Though she always tries to see the glass half full, she uses her reasoning to inform me of the negatives of the world. She reminds me that negative is the antonym of positive and that you can always find good in the bad. My mom has taught me that as a Catholic, we are born to love and accept everyone. Everyone, regardless of race, religion, skin color, or sexuality. Through her, I have developed my love for social justice and human rights. I am lucky to have someone in my life, someone in my life willing to have tough conversations with me about the world. Because of my mom, I am an informed teenager looking to impact the world in a positive way, advocating equality and charity for all. Next year, I will be, I will be pursuing a Bachelor of Fine Arts in Musical Theater. I have been blessed with a mom who supports and encourages the influence of art and theater in my life. My mom has never missed a show and is always in the audience cheering me on as my number one fan. My mom has blessed me with the opportunity to attend a private school in order to continue to shape and intertwine my faith life into my academics. My faith is something that is incredibly close to me. Combining that with my love of communicating and public speaking, being a Dominican preacher has been a rewarding and fulfilling experience. Being able to express my, express my faith and opinions to those around me through the gift of preaching is so effective and so important. Preaching has become part of my identity. In college next year, I will use the skills I've acquired through preaching every day. Performing like preaching incorporates using my voice to express a point of view or educate an audience. My mom has taught me from a young age that my voice as a young woman is valid and should be recognized. She tells me to believe in myself and trust my character. As a young, ambitious woman in modern America, my perspective on the world is incredibly unique. I am growing up during a time of immense change. My mom raised me to know that I am a crucial part of that change. I can decide how I want to see the world. I can choose to add positivity or negativity to that change. Thankfully, my mom has encouraged me to add positivity. I encourage every single one of you in this room to look at a strong female figure in your life during times of distress or need. Strong women have encountered obstacles to get where they are. Know that the obstacles you face in your life are there to not only challenge you, but to help you learn and grow. Because of my mom, I can enter the adult world knowing who I am, what I want, and how to get there. If nothing else, in 10 years, I just want to make my mom proud. I hope to be half of the woman my mom is one day. She's a loyal wife, a trusted friend, a coveted mother, and the greatest role model I could have ever hoped for. I would like to close with a quote by Rachel Martin, an American journalist. A real mom, emotional yet the rock, tired but keeps going, worried but full of hope, impatient yet patient, overwhelmed but never quits, amazing even though doubted, wonderful even in the chaos, and a life changer every single day.